Alright, hey guys, welcome back to yet another part of Reverse Rebirth, and this time we are going to do literally the worst, most piece of shit world in Reverse Rebirth, and that is Wonderland. I would say I'm excited, but I'm not. Not even a little bit. So ideally, I'm going to skip through this world as fast as possible, just to get it over with. But... Oh... <laughs> uh... Okay... Alright, by my calculations, I gotta go up here, then across to here, then back here, and then up here. So that means I have to open one, two, three, four, five. I just have to open five rooms and I'm good. <sighs> Ideally, I would have five bottomless darknesses and then just, you know, yeah, and then use a save point, but that's just not gonna happen. Now, why why am I so worried? Why? Because, you know, I like... I like to assume that, you know, there are people watching my playthroughs that have not played the games that I'm, you know, recording, and instead they're just here to, you know, enjoy and watch, and, you know, learn something. Well, if you've been watching Reverse Rebirth, you know that I can't edit my decks, and I get a set deck for every world, and that's the one I have to use. Well, this is the one for Wonderland. I get nine attacking cards. They number from one to five. And that's it. There are no zeros, there's nothing higher than five. And in case you were wondering, yes, the enemies, I believe, and the boss use cards higher than five. So what does that mean? It means I cannot card break them. Now, I... I guess this might be helpful. Deflects frontal physical attacks and completely nullifies damage. That would be useful, except it only lasts for one reload, and I only have nine cards, so I can do three combos. Tops, if I don't get broken. Uh, ta uh, Jafar is gonna be a godsend. And, I mean, yeah, that's... Yeah. Welcome to hell. There's no point in shortcutting anything. Fuck. Fuck. up. Alright, perfect. If they can still card break me with Feeble Darkness in place, I'm gonna be upset. Like, to be honest. Oh god, the honkers are back. And the flower fucks. It is only marginally better because I reload instantly. So I don't have my shit going up to three, uh, three reload whatevers. I don't have the counter increasing like I would with Sora is what I'm trying to say. But that honestly does not make me feel much better about this. And you say that isn't that bad. You might be saying that right now. Well, that's because right now the enemy's cards are at minus two. But as you saw, the honkers are using four cards, which means they normally have sixes, which means... Which means... I'm fucked, basically. I mean, there's really no way around it. Right in the down under. Face itches. A room where many heartless appear. No thank you. Wow, I have four? Shit.
Alright, awesome. Oh no. There's no straight way. Alright, if I go this way, I have one, two, three, four. If I go this way, I have one, two, three, four. So it really doesn't matter. Like, they keep giving me a choice, like it matters, and it doesn't. And you know what? You know what? I'm gonna look something up. Reverse. Rebirth. Neverland map. I'm not Neverland, Atlantica. Not Atlantica, Wonderland, Jesus. I don't think there are maps available online. That's unfortunate. Uh, well, poopy. I wanted to cheat, but the internet said no. Not today, sir. I mean, I'm gonna have to come in this direction eventually. <laughs> so, I mean, I may as well open this room, because... Whether it leads to whether it leads to continuing on to Trickmaster or not, needs to open it. No, <laughs> no, fuck no, not using that shit. Ah, oh, man, I'm almost at the bottom of darkness. Like I'm really sad. Like I'm about to open a roulette room because I haven't used them the whole game and it's getting ridiculous. All right, and now I know. Now I know. And now, you know, I don't have to worry about opening shit later. It's taken care of. God damn it. It's a sign. I gotta open a roulette room. It would be immoral not to at this point. Also, I have a literal shit ton right now. problem is there are it is it is a pretty big room where the fuck am I I definitely picked the wrong world to start farming mad cards like most other people would have done this like you know good world good deck and I'm just like no no Wonderland's good for me Oh, that was an accident! No, when I- when I have full HP, everything gives HP balls. And when I'm almost dead, nothing does. It's the way of the world. Alright, here we go. Safe point. I'm taking that shit. Fuck yeah. Need more blues in general. Because I have almost none, and if a door requires blues later on, I am fucked. Oh, that thing confuses you. I have made a very big mistake. Oh. Alright, Would they do that though? Would they give me a card duel in this world with cards above 6? I really think they would. No, I guess the game takes into account that you don't have cards above 5. Because otherwise that would be a very dick move. I think I'm leaving. I feel like a little bit of tranquility right now.
You have to expect that Wonderland is gonna be built like shit. Like, you really can't be like, oh, Wonderland is gonna have a straightforward map. This is not true, because it's fucking Wonderland. It is the worst world in the series. Like, I'm saying this now. It's appeared in two games, and in both games, it was a fucking train wreck. And I'm going to admit, I've kind of run out of things to say, because so far, and I hope I'm not jinxing this, but so far, this has been kind of anticlimactically... Eh. Marshall Waken. That's what I'm looking for. Get that good card boost. I don't have zeros anyway, why do I give a fuck? And I open the door to here, make that a safe point. And you know I'm golden. Hmm, I actually just thought of a really interesting challenge. You would have to use, like, some sort of code breaker for, uh, or something for, uh, recon for PS2. But, what if someone did a challenge where for each world that Riku has, you do that same world as Sora, but with the, with the cards that Riku has at that time? I think that would be really interesting to watch. More difficult, for sure, because you don't instantly reload. But... Oh, and you wouldn't have magic or anything, either. But, I think that would be really interesting, actually. Someone should get on that. Get a code breaker. And recom. Of course, Wonderland wouldn't be that bad, because it's one of the first worlds. For Sora, but... Still... I got that covered. Do they even st still sell code breakers? Heh. <laughs> the time. 420 blaze it faggot. No, but uh, anyway, uh... I, I have no idea where to get a code breaker. Like, I used to love when, on my uh, Kingdom Hearts 2 videos, like, people would accuse me of using a code breaker, because I'm like, I don't even know where people buy those. Like, I've never looked it up, so I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. Clearly, you're on some strong shit, and I'm sorry. Alright. So this is gonna be ass. Just unrelenting ass. Can't break that. Very important that I don't use a single slight or else I'm fucked.
Oh fuck, because I had a 9 Mickey. Alright, so that was not difficult at all. I don't know what the fuck. This this whole world was an anti-climax. <laughs> like I was expecting, you know, a long difficult battle. No, you just card break him to death. And I could have really no damage to that, but I fucked up near the beginning, which is really unfortunate. Like, I never actually go for no damages, but it's always really, like, depressing when you're so close to one and you just don't get it because of a stupid mistake. I got hit once. But, whatever. Time to leave. And never come back. Like my uh, Terra fight in my Kingdom Hearts 2 Final Mix playthrough, which I got a no damage on. Which it honestly might have been the first time I ever no damaged him. Ever. And then, like, ba basically like two people noticed. Or like, actually said something about it in the comments. Then the rest of the comments were about something stu like stupid that I put in the, uh... I, I put in the, uh... You know, the thing. You know what I'm talking about, right? Credits. There we go. Credits. I put, like, some annotation in the credits because it was like a teaser trailer for my Birth by Sleep playthrough that I did two parts of and then Birth by Sleep Final Mix got announced and then I was like, no, I'm not doing this. And then, yeah, really depressing. But I, w I was just like, guys, but I, but I didn't take, I didn't take damage though. Like, guys, please. Ah, oh, fuck it. Once I've beaten the boss, I ain't fighting anybody else. Plus, there's another boss to fight. <laughs> Who could I be talking about? That's actually pretty obvious. He might body me free, I don't know, because he's weird in Recom. Like, I know how to fight him in Cage 2 fm but then, like, Recom... I don't... Like, I don't... I don't know what's going on in the Recom fight, to be honest. do this shit. That scent. You're another one of those nobodies. You've done well thus far. But to possess your powers and yet fear the darkness. What a waste. I do not fear it. I sense that you do. You're also capable of controlling the darkness. Cast away your useless fear. Open your heart. Embrace the darkness. And if I say no? 
Then you lose both light and darkness. And disappear. I, Lexius, will not yield to the frail heart of an infantile coward. Now, stop resisting. And let the darkness in! Lexius, you goofy motherfucker. This is the only important thing you do in the series. Shut up. Wow, this got serious. Quick. Oh my god. Card duel? He has a shit ton of HP! Oh no, he's powering up! He powers up! He doesn't flinch anymore! Oh no! <laughs> Still have card duels. Where's my fucking zero? <laughs> Stop him. I can't stop him. <laughs> Yo, you missed a rock, bro. Oh no. <laughs> oh, this is bad. My zero. I don't have a zero shortcutted because the deck changes between worlds. Uh. <laughs> All right. <coughs> All right. <coughs> oh god, I can handle this. Don't tell me I'm about to get stuck on fucking Lexius. Like I'm going to kill myself. go he had me shook for a second but yo know, it's no problem dark mode holds me down yet again
I gained two levels. So yes, I am under leveled because that shouldn't be happening. I've that is I've never seen that happen to me before. Hey, hey, clear bonus, nice. But yeah, I've never seen that happen to me before. Why did it say clear bonus? I don't get it. Uh, gonna boost my DP, and then I'm gonna boost my HP. You're finished. Don't mock me. You were too much trouble. Too slow. You are the superiors. Forgive me, Zexion. This was a fight I should not have started. Lexius! Riku, I can I see your heart. heart. No, it's not. Darkness this foul could only... only be... That's it. Remember me. Let me drift into your heart. Ansem! <laughs> You called out my name. You have been thinking about me. Like, do you want to suck his You're dick? Like, what is of the this? Darkness I command. Good. The more you think of me, the closer my return draws. And when I have awoken, I will take hold. Your heart will be mine! The king. He protected me. Your majesty? Where are you? Please answer! You're with me, aren't you? Alright. Well, now that that's taken care of. Alexius is gone as well. Vexen, Larxene, Lexius. I wonder who will be next in line. I thought perhaps it might be you. Me? No way. I already took my pounding from Sora. He hey yo! For good. No, I think it'll be Marluxia next. For defying the organization and targeting Sora. I hope he moves exactly as his heart commands him to. So, what about you? I thought you guys had plans for Riku. Yes, we were going to set him off against the traitors. But with Marluxia gone, there is no more need. 
He is nothing but a nuisance now. And he's dangerous as well. After all, he took down Lexius. You know, that is not how I do things. Tell me, did you obtain the data on Riku's home? Fuck out of here. Fuck you, and fuck the dick you rode in on! Fuck. Well, that fight took a couple of years off my lifespan. Fuck yeah, motherfucker. Now let's go home. Yeah, huh? What? One of the senses died. A really strong one. Huh? The keeper of this castle, Marluxia, has just been felled by the Keyblade Master. Keyblade? You mean Sora? Sora is here? Yes. Want to see him? But... Can you face him? What's that mean? The world of darkness, end and some shadow, still nest within your heart. Do you plan to face Sora like that? Are you not ashamed? <laughs> Sora's fate is to battle the darkness. He must oppose anyone who hosts the dark. In other words, it's you. If you don't believe the words I say, then you had best see the truth with your own eyes. This card... This is our... Yes. It is your home. All right, cool. So, I believe that's all I've got for you guys for this part. So, thanks for watching, and see you next time.